something for you. Ah, you're here. It appears everyone has arrived. Last night, I visited a former servant who once worked for my family. I was able to learn the entirety of what happened, although in my great-grandfather's generation, the Ishin art was tasked with forging an important Goshinto according to an ancient forging, though all the craftsmen involved were very experienced. The process was still unsuccessful. When the deadline came, the blade still wasn't finished. So the craftsmen all fled and hid for fear of punishment. The Kaidahara clan and Yashiro commission then conducted an investigation. My great-grandfather and the head of the Kamisato clan eventually tracked down the craftsmen near the seaside. However, they met fierce resistance from the craftsmen, and in the end they were unable to prevent them from escaping by sea. The Kaidahara clan was severely punished for the swordsmiths that had escaped. Moreover, I heard that the head of the Kamisato clan was injured by the fleeing swordsmiths. Yes. The sudden passing of the family head left the Kamisato clan leaderless. Treacherous people took advantage of the situation. This single incident had profound effects. Even after the position as head of the clan was passed to my father, the Kamisato clan still wasn't able to regain its prior reputation. But, thanks to my brother, everything is getting better now. The failure to forge the blade was ultimately attributed to a lack of required skill and finesse. However, the story of the five Kasen seems to imply that the failure didn't stem from a lack of skill. Miss Kamisato, I heard yesterday that the Yashiro Commission has still kept the diagram. Ever Might I ask you to do me a favor? Yes, I understand. I will go back and search for the diagram. Rain. One way to wash off the grime. managed to find the old diagram. Hmm. Though the diagram is well preserved, you can Oh, that's pretty old. At this point, we can only try our luck and see how... Although the effect is not too obvious, you can still see that some words have... Kazuha, this is clear evidence that this chart was indeed tampered with. I see. But I fear that I've discovered this secret too late. When my grandfather was young, he proposed reviving the Ishin art many times to my great-grandfather. Yesterday, the former family servant said that my great-grandfather even went to the Yashiro Commission to request that diagram from the head of the Kamisato clan. He then showed that diagram to my grandfather. Sure enough, my grandfather also failed. My great-grandfather then told my grandfather left Inazuma in a rage after hearing those words. He didn't... Looking back at it now, the argument between the two of them was simply... Oh, cause... I heard that your great-grandfather was very industrious when he was young. But later in life, he no longer bothered with the forging arts. Kazuha, did your great-grandfather really say, if you can't find the secret within? Yes. The servant said that he personally heard those. My grandfather was so angry at the time that he smashed my great-grandfather's cherished- Yes, it appears that you understand my meaning. Kazuha, if your great-grandfather thought that the Ishin art lacked finesse, then after witnessing his son's failure- But instead he said, if you can't find the secret within- Huh? So you're saying, my great-grandfather may have very well known that the- Yes. The current evidence suggests that is highly likely. I apologize, but 
Would you all please accompany me to the... T After I became a wanted criminal, the Tenryo Commission seized my family's last remain... I want to inquire about the whereabouts of those belongings. All right, let's get... What are you all doing here? Did something happen? Kujo Sara. Yes, I do. You're Kaedehara Kazuha, a wanted criminal during the Vision Hunt decree. Sara, we'd like to ask about the Kaedehara clan's property that was seized by the Ten- Yes, the items seized at that time are currently stored in the warehouse next to the police station. No, I'm afraid you misunderstand. I'm not here to reclaim those belongings. I see. All right, I'll inform the police station. Thank you, Sara! <clears throat> Kaedehara. That's all in the past now, Kujo Sara. There's no need to mention it again. <clears throat> However, may I ask something of you? Yes? What is it? Currently, I have no plans to stay in Inazuma. As a result, the- Madam Kujo, I believe you are a person of integrity. After our investigation is over, I'd like to ask if you can handle those belongings for me. Please, sell them, and use the money to help the poor. All right, I understand. I've already informed the police station. As for all the belongings left by the Kaedehara clan, Ah, you must be here to investigate the Kaedahara clan's belongings. Well, Madame Cujo's already informed me of the situation. Ah, the Kaedahara clan's belongings are stored in this warehouse. Unfortunately, the items are scattered throughout in order to save space. However, I have clearly marked the corresponding items, so they shouldn't be too difficult to find. I'll be waiting for you at the door. Please, come see me if you require any assistance. Kazuha, since the items are scattered throughout the building, I propose we split up and look for clues. Yes, sounds like a plan. Hmm. Oh, it's you. I'm currently investigating the sword rack. Oh. Since the Kaidahara clan was a family of renowned swordsmiths... I'm afraid not. Although the sword rack is made of fine wood, the swords placed here appear to be quite ordinary. The blade on the sword hasn't been sharpened, but there are many signs of use on the hilt. Let Paimon see! Oh, there seems to be a couple uneven characters etched... Paimon can imagine what Kazuha was... I will continue investigating here and call you if I find anything interesting. Oh, it's you. Unfortunately, I have yet to f- Whoa! It yes. Perhaps if it were better maintained, then it could fetch a decent price. I was taking a closer look just now and noticed a large piece of dirt caught in the fabric fibers on the back side. The soil is deeply embedded into the cloth. That means a great deal of force was used when the dirt was lodged into the cloth. Because this is not what we are looking for now. Let me think. If I wanted to leave a message behind... Albedo seems to be thinking pretty hard. Hmm... There must... 
must be some around here. Do you see all these pots here? Some of them are bound to have liquor inside. <laughs> hey! Everyone else is trying hard to help. <laughs> I merely jest, of course. Well, Paimon doesn't really get why Kazuha told Sara to sell all these belongings. What if we don't end up finding anything today? Then... I know you are worried about Kazuha. Since Kazuha made such a request to Sara, that indicates he's already made his choice. No, not intuition. Rather, I've lived for a long time now. Leave the things here to me. You two can look around elsewhere. What did you find, Shinkyo? I found quite the pile of old books. These books here are all related to smelting steel. And these are about the process of forging blades. Hmm. The books about plants and flowers must have been... I skimmed through them just now, but I didn't find anything particularly worth noting. I shall take a closer look and let you know if I find anything. Everyone, I've found something that you should all have a look at. Oh, seems Kazuha discovered something. Let's go see what he's got! This flower pot was in my house for a long time. I heard that it was left behind by my great- Yeah, the plants seem to have been dead for a while now. Well, after my great-grandfather stopped studying the forging arts, he picked up the hobby of keeping bonsai plants. But he specifically left behind this dead plant at the time. My grandfather deeply regretted that he never managed to reconcile with my great-grandfather. But now that I think about it, my great-grandfather could very well have left it behind for other reasons. Mm -hmm. Yes. Let's take... We finally found something! Do you think someone already discovered the... No, I do not think that is the case here. See the paper? It's quite yellowed, which means it's very old. Hmm. You mean to say that these sheets have been written with special... Yes, I... Okay! There is a pond outside the police station. <sighs> well, how did it go? The Just as everyone guessed, after I sprinkled some water onto the paper, writing did indeed begin to appear on it. Oh? What does the letter say? It is. I'll tell you what my great-grandfather knew at the time, but everyone, please follow. Dehara, why did you lead us to this beach? It is. In fact, my great-grandfather and the head of the Kamisato clan tracked the fleeing swordsmiths to this... Our hypothesis was correct. My great-grandfather was well aware of the truth behind the defective blades. It reads, to whoever reads this letter, I, Kaidehara Yoshinori, have been held to a certain secret throughout my entire life. All those years ago, when I was pursuing the swordsmiths alongside Commissioner Kamisato of the Yashiro Commission, I was not injured by one of the fleeing smiths. It was night, and after the clues led us down to shore, I waited for the culprits to show themselves. 
However, there were no swordsmiths in sight, only a single eccentric stranger. This stranger claimed to be the one behind the failed forgings and said that he had been patiently waiting for us. He then threatened to destroy the Raiden Gokaden. That person was of able body, and in a blink of an eye, myself and the accompanying samurai had been defeated. Commissioner Kamisato was severely wounded, and I barely escaped death myself. My hat had fortunately blunted a blow to my head. The unusual stranger could have easily claimed my life at that moment. But, after noticing my appearance, he stopped his attacks and sternly asked if I had any connection with the name Niwa. I answered that it was my father's surname, and after my father disappeared, I was adopted by the Kayadahara family. Upon hearing my answer, the stranger paused. After a long silence, he suddenly said, Tell her this. My name is Kuni Kuzushi. He then turned and left. Yes. My great-grandfather and the head of the Kamisato clan escaped from death and learned that the forging diagram had been tampered with by... However, due to the encounter, the head of the Kamisato clan was worried that my great-grandfather would be falsely accused of being involved with the perpetrator because the perpetrator said he would destroy the Raiden Gokaden. My great-grandfather worried that the perpetrator would still return for vent. He said, as the leader of the Kaidahara clan, I am deeply ashamed to witness the decline of the Ishin art. Yes, that's right. If my grandpa had somehow discovered the secret behind the tampered di Unfortunately, he failed to catch any of the hints in my- Miss Kamisato, it appears you were unaware of the happenings that my great- Hmm. I suppose the reason the head of the Kamisato house never spoke of this to the family, if the perpetrator was capable of tampering with even the Shogun's diagrams, and could single-handedly defeat many men, I will discuss this matter with brother shortly, and investigate the identity behind the one called Kuni Kuzushi. To be honest, as I read the letter, I felt much turbulence in my heart. My great-grandfather said in the letter that he did not wish his descendants to blindly seek revenge. Though he was in a tight situation when he wrote these words, I think what's most important for each person is not the past, but the present. Therefore, knowing the truth behind what happened, that being said, if the enemy from all those years ago is still lurking and plotting to stir up more trouble, then I doubt. These are simply insights I've gathered from all that I've exp- Thank you all for accompanying me in my search for the- Great! Now that we're done here- Don't worry. The unveiling ceremony will be starting shortly. I will say that I'm most satisfied with this particular work. <laughs> is that so? Anyway, there is still time before the ceremony. Got something for ya! Yes, there were many things which required my attention these past few days. Fortunately, the Iridori Festival is proceeding smoothly. Brother and I are very grateful for your help. Hmm. Toma sure is taking his sweet time. Yes. Today is one of the rare occasions when Brother isn't busy. 
I was going to buy some books, but he said he wanted to come along. His treat. However, he forgot his wallet at home, so he- Hyman didn't think Ayato could ever be for- <laughs> Brother always works diligently, and it so Toma and I really cherish such moments. Traveler, Paimon, it's a pleasure to see you. Indeed it did. Thanks to you, the signing event went off without a hitch. Uh, Shito. You aren't mistaken. Though, after all, I came to Inazuma under the pretext of evaluating a potential investment. Fortunately, the crowds of readers that came flocking over have kept the usual tourists at bay. Oh, I should mention, Shu is also unaware of the real purpose of my trip. Then... Please accept my thanks in advance. I'm sorry that I can't chat long. I'll see you later at the unveiling ceremony for Kuronushi's portrait. Lots of people came to buy books today. Though the signing process wasn't difficult, I heard that not only is Jin Yu heir to a Li Yue merchant family, but he also created the entire novel without ever telling his family. Hmm. Perhaps next time we should try to write a story about a novelist based on Jin Yu. So, we were merely discussing wine and food. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Speaking of good sides with sake... Ugh, forget it. Even if those two are plotting... I came here to take in the sea breeze. Such a bustling atmosphere. <laughs> I knew you were still worth. Thank you. But please, don't worry. Look. See this familiar harbor in front of us? But now? Not only are foreigners coming to Inazuma again. Yeah. Inazuma has already started to change, huh? I was thinking. In some ways, it might take a different amount of time for different. And when they finally let go. Don't worry about me. You should... Everyone, welcome to the magnificent Iridori Festival. Today, we have ushered in the final stage of our festival, and now we will reveal the final portrait of the five Kasen. Hyman has no idea what a- Let's all count down together. Three, two, one. <laughs> huh? What's this? I suppose Calx must have forgotten to include the character. <clears throat> uh, let's hear some words from Calx himself regarding the crea- Hello, everyone. First, I would like to say that it the five Kasen are legendary figures from ancient Inazuma, famous for their works of poetry. I learned from existing sources about those stories that the character of Kuronushi is the- Moreover, Kuronushi lacks a dedicated chapter among the stories. Perhaps we can assume that every creator had a different understanding of Kuronushi. After all, the Iridori Festival is a place for everyone, 
to express their minds through creative work. Yep, that's all beautiful for ya. His super logical explanation is sure to win every... Well, it seems that our adventures at the Iridori Festival have come to a close. Huh? Oh. Oh, right! We... Really? Come on then, who is it? Tell Paimon! Well, that makes sense. Right. Even though they were using stories to hint us toward Shincho's troubles, the real goal was to... Oh! <gasps> Paimon gets it now. Let's go. We'll get to the... The one who left the stories of the five Kasan. Huh? Really? <laughs> but seeing as you stumbled upon me, because other than me... To be honest, I am very grateful to the one who left those stories for us to find. And I am also very fortunate to have you. So many people. Oh, are you asking about the one who left the stories of the five Kasin? But things may be a little more. The person who left behind the stories of the five Kasan, after all, if they wanted to simply tell me what happened. Yes, in fact, before doing the portrait of Kuro Nushi. I visited the person who left those stories and confirmed a few things. I think my current approach to this portrait is the most correct one. Oh, reveal thyself. Got something for ya. Ayato! You're the one behind this but don't you think you overdid it a little? <laughs> As it just so happened. Huh. Paimon wants to First of all. The start of this whole incident was due to mere happenstance. You see, Lady Yai happened to catch sight of Xingqiu and the editor carrying the books away one night. Huh? So Paimon knew it! This thing had me go over- That's right. But using the story of the five Kassen to guide you to the- As for my roundabout approach... Well, yes. Due to a certain incident that occurred earlier, I knew there was more than meets the eye regarding those papers. What Kaedehara Yoshinori said in the letter is very important for both the Kamisato clan- The Kaedehara clan used to be subordinates of the Kamisato clan, although he has the right to know the truth. Of course, I could outright tell him the truth that I had discovered. If he lacks the ability, then he wouldn't be able to find the truth in the first place. Kaedehara Yoshinori left his message in a roundabout. For a long time, I yearned for a suitable opportunity to convey this matter. Oh, Paimon gets it now. <laughs> I merely saw that this matter would be a- And more importantly, I hope that while Kazuha and I are reliable friends who would be willing to protect them and make met because it is also very likely that you will face this- You already know the answer deep down and The answer is actually hidden in when there is no one else near the portrait. You can As for the means of revealing that answer. near the portrait, you can confirm with your own eyes. As for the means of revealing that answer. Also, there's one last thing that we must discuss. I mentioned earlier that the occurrence of a certain incident made me- It was just after the Shogun announced the abolition of the Sokoku Decree. 
they had discovered signs that someone had entered the warehouse story- I felt something unusual about that incident, so I told Kujo Sara of the Tenryo Commission to treat it as if nothing happened. In the meantime, I sent a member of the Shumatsuban to keep watch over the warehouse. You mean... he was up- <laughs> I let him search for a while, but in the end... Why didn't you send someone to catch- <laughs> The best way to protect a secret is to treat it as if it doesn't exist, is it not? After he left Inazuma, I carefully checked the Kaidahara clan's belongings one- I am certain that the papers are the secret which the infiltrator sought to f So, now on to my final question. Which part of Kaidahara Yoshinori's experiences was the secret that needed to be protected? <laughs> As for now, please, enjoy yourselves at the Iridori Fest. Blessing now ten percent off.